Hi, I'm Paul Gattani. In this brief video, we'll talk about configuring access to the attestation toolkit in Workforce Central. In order to configure access to ATK workspaces in Workforce Central, we need to assign custom URLs, we need to update existing Genie profiles, and we need to create and assign widgets, and of course, assign those to appropriate workspaces. You want to create at least three custom URLs, one for employees, one for managers, and one for administrators. If users will be accessing the system using mobile devices, be sure to assign mobile view and mobile phone view screens custom URL assignment as well. We'll want to create three single link widgets for employees and managers to access attestation toolkit workspaces. One for my timestamp, one for time review, and one for my approvals. For system administrators, we will copy and rename the 00 Quick Links widget and add all of the ATK workspaces to the Quick Links widget. Now that we've created the widgets, we'll go ahead and modify employee, manager, and system administrator workspaces as needed. First thing we'll do is we'll copy and rename the My Information 00 My Information workspace. We'll change the layout from two column to top to bottom. We will add the My Timestamp and Time Review single link widgets we just created as appropriate. And we will make My Timestamp the only visible widget by default. Time Review should be the first visible widget in related items. For the managers, we'll want to copy and rename the 00 Manage My Department workspace, and we'll add the All My Approvals single link widget. We do want to make sure that it is the first visible widget in the related items pane. Just a quick note, the My Approvals workspace can be accessed directly through the single link widget or using Go-To Control Navigation. For system administrators, we'll copy and rename the 00 administration workspace and we'll replace the 00 quick links widget with the one we just created. Now that we've configured widgets and workspaces, we'll need to configure navigators. We'll start by copying and renaming the 00 employee template. We'll then replace the My Information workspace with the employee workspace that we just created. For managers, we'll start by copying and renaming the manager template. We'll replace the Manage My Department with the Manage My Department workspace that we just created. For manager employee, template, we will copy and rename the manager employee template. We will replace the manage my department workspace with the new manager workspace that we just created. In addition, we will replace the my information workspace with the employee workspace that we just created. And you can see here, I've simply added two more zeros to the front of my name for my workspaces. Then we click save. For the system administrator, we'll start by, yep, copying and renaming the 00 system administrator template. We'll replace the 00 administrator workspace with the system administrator workspace we just created. Also, we will replace the 00 manage my department and 00 my information workspaces with the man manager and employee workspaces that we just created. And we'll click Save. Now, if you aren't using automatic assignment of navigators that's available in Workforce Central 8, then you will need to create a navigator profile by moving your desired navigator from available to selected, and then selecting that navigator 
under Navigator Selections in the Display Profile for all the appropriate employees, managers, and administrators. ATK 4.2 supports configuring alerts for ATK exceptions in Workforce Central 7 and 8. Refer to the 4.2 configuration guide for detailed information on how to configure those exceptions. You will want to be aware once that you've configured the alerts widget, you'll want to add it to the appropriate navigators. Those navigators that we just modified, you will want to add the alerts to once you finish configuring those. And that's all we need to do to configure access to ATK workspaces in Workforce Central. That concludes this module.